Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Aliens The Dark Descent. We've just successfully defended the Otago from uh, an assault of the aliens. So they know we're here, um, but it was successful. We got quite a bit of experience and a few Xeno samples and such, and it was fun. It was a fun mission because it happens outside and <laughs> you don't need to really hide much. Our planet infestation is going up quite considerably, so that's... It's a little bit uh, worrying. Uh, we've spent all the physicians in the medical quarters. Uh, so these guys should be ready the next day. <clears throat> That's very good. I've been told that you can... Uh, Dr. Lok told me that you can actually use the same physician... I mean, you can use several physicians on one single person, which is interesting. I thought they just disappeared once you assigned a physician to them. Um... Actually, no, they don't, do they? Okay, so that's uh, another new thing I know. Um, right, we've got nothing Need a gun, administrator? in the workshop. We've got the heavy pulse rifle, but it is quite expensive. And yeah, we need to get some level 6 marines uh, out and about first. So, let's go to the command deck and let's go to the next day. Or let's go to the laboratory. Welcome, Administrator Hayes. We can do the extraction device, but, hmm. I don't know. It is ten Xeno samples. But you know what? Let's do it anyway. Finally, a project worthy of my talents. So now we've got embryo extraction. Uh, allows you to heal a marine from a face hugger implantation. That's pretty good, I would say. Uh, of course, you have to pay for it. Every time you go out, which kind of sucks, but there you New go. objectives are awaiting your Rookie review. Rookie Airhawk Warrior suffers from a nervous breakdown. Order the Marine to rest. He becomes exhausted. Are, are you finished? Gains a random trauma. Let's uh, let him rest. <clears throat> he was ordered to rest. All right, so we've got one exhausted Marine, nine available Marines, so that's good. We've got unassigned physicians. Administrator Hayes. Uh, so we could definitely do that. Let's assign a physician. This one's a priority. Understood. I see. You can assign another one. Okay. That's cool. Huh. Well, I mean, I might as well, even though we're gonna come back, and then we might have, you know, marines that are hurt. So let's see what we're dealing with first. Why does it have to load these textures every time? That's a bit annoying. So... Yeah, the planet infestation level. Has it not increased? I thought it was already at this point. Pioneer Station. Oh, we're going back. Return to Pioneer Station to deactivate the server's protocol. Five primary objectives, two secondary ones, 17 data pads. So not that much. I think we can all do it in one go. Understood. Uploading mission data. So let's see, what kind of squad do we got? Bad luck. We've got Dr. Loco. Uh... Need to change that. Uh, <laughs> I just can't. I can't look and just yeah. <laughs> uh, we got Private Noobster, Trigger Finger, and Triviata. Wow, we've got <clears throat> that's pretty good. Two level sixes. Xenomorphobia. Take uh, the Marine takes 0 0.2 stress damage per second when a Xenomorph is in view. That's not great. Maybe you need to go. And get rid of that. Um, hmm. So it would be nice if you could quickly jump over to uh, back to the barracks. I mean the barracks and the medical quarters, because we've got honor here. He's a recon, so let's spend another physician. This one's a priority. We're Understood. going to replace... Yeah, we're going to do psychiatric care and get Noobster in day. No, not Noobster. Where are you? Trigger finger. Three days. Okay. Let's start the therapy. Understood. I'll update my schedule. There we go. Trigger finger. Will heal two trauma stop therapy. Okay. So three days. Um, I guess it gets rid of two, two of these points per day then. Okay, what else do we got? No trauma, no trauma, no trauma. Hmm. 
Oh, two trauma points per day. Yeah, it even says so. Um, okay. VKSP. I mean, these guys that are not going on a mission, we can put into uh, in here. So they can heal what little trauma they have. I mean, it does say no trauma, but they're building up. Um... So let's see. A good day to you, Who are we taking? Operations ready in the following mm -hmm. areas. Understood. Uploading mission So we're taking data. Dr. Loco with bad luck. Marine earns one a less XP for each opponent. That sucks. Uh, we got Noobster, Honor, and Triviata. I would like a gunner, though. Oh, yeah, because she's a sergeant, so we need a gunner. Yeah. Okay, so KSP, Honor, Noobster, and Loco. Hello, Administrator Hayes. Stay safe, okay? Okay, so KSP Triviata can go into Understood. therapy. Understood. I'll update my schedule. And these guys will be going on a mission. Alright. They do have Mind of Steel, which is nice. Automatically heals one trauma point per campaign turn. That is very, very nice. Okay. Uh, now, let's launch the mission. Understood. Uploading mission data. <clears throat> Alright. That's good. We got a gunner. Why do you not have a smart gun? There you go. Alright. Smart gun it is. You've got the sniper rifle and a revolver. You've got mines. You've got an incinerator. And you've got a shotgun. And everyone has a revolver. And these guys could actually also have the big gun. So might as well buy it, right? Hello, Administrator Hayes. So we're going back again. Workshop. Let's get the heavy pulse rifle. Buy this baby. Forewarned is forearmed. Hell yeah. And then we got a plasma rifle. I wish it didn't show you how many upgrades there were and what they were. I really kind of wish so. I like to be surprised. Operations ready in the following areas. Understood. Uploading mission data. All right, let's do this. Uh, so, heavy pulse rifle. No uh, grenade launcher. That's true, though. Look at that thing. All right, two heavy pulse rifles and one normal pulse rifle. Because the grenade launcher is very nice. Uh, I think that's... That's pretty cool, though. I like that balance. So, you know, you get more firepower, but you don't get the grenade launcher, which is very, very nice. Uh, we'll see how these work. All right, let's select the inventory. Oh, you're tired. Ah. You're tired. And you're not. Hmm. I guess we'll go like this, then. Yeah. And let's get some mines. Let's get some mines for you. And a revolver. That kind of sucks, actually. Uh, that uh, we don't get a... We don't get a thing, you know. And I cannot customize them from here. That's unfortunate. I just wanted to give them, you know, helmets and such. Alright, let's select the inventory. We are, of course, taking all four of our sentry guns. I could go for just three, just in case we get another one there. I suppose I can do that. Uh, but having four is very nice indeed. So there's the embryo extraction. Now, the, the only problem is you don't really know what you're going to be facing um, on the mission. So which one should I take? You know, should I take the detection time increase should i take the stasis grenade should i take extra armor it is quite expensive so i'll take this just in case and i'll take the extra armor oh no all right let's launch the mission wait did i oh shoot did i do a did i use all the um medical personnel I didn't. <laughs> okay. Let's do that. This one's a priority. A Understood. So I might as well 
Might as well do this. And then, because you're paranoid, you can go here. Understood. I'll update my schedule. There. Hello, Administrator okay. Hayes. Maybe now we're actually going to do a mission. Would be Understood. quite something, wouldn't Uploading it? mission data. <laughs> okay, so we've got incinerator, sniper, mine, shotgun, rifle, heavy rifle, rifle. Okay, good. Revolvers all around. Okay, that looks good. Oh, Dr. Loco is also tired. It would be nice if it actually showed you that here. That's nice. Kleptomaniac. Conspirator. Ah. Uh, I do need to level these guys up. Brawler. While the squad is resting, another random marine in the squad suffers one health points damage. Medical assistant attributes? I don't think we do, right? Combat drugs. Medical assistant, there we go. Okay, so that's gonna be prevented. So we're gonna take uh, Craddock with us. Okay. Uh, and yes, I know, we're going back again. I'm going to the medical quarters and putting Loco, Dr. Loco here into therapy. Understood. I'll update my schedule. And KSP, okay, available therapy slots zero. Operations ready in the following areas. Understood. Uploading mission data. Okay. Double check everything. I mean, going in with a level 1 is a bit yikes, but um, I do have to level them at some point. And I think because of that, we are... Yeah, we're gonna get the extra armor and the extraction device. Alright, let's launch this baby. Whew. This is gonna be close quarters in that place. So the cool thing is, they told me that... Oh, oh, what's going on here? Oh no, it didn't close the doors! No, it didn't. No, it didn't. Oh no, it's not even there! <laughs> Bye. Bye. In case you didn't think it could get worse, those same platforms that downed the Otago are now planning to nuke Lethe from orbit. The good news is that Director Price, Hayes' boss, Reckon she can shut it down before we're all extra crispy. The bad news is that means going back up to Pioneer Station. You'll need to restore emergency power, then retrieve a code breaker from the team Price sent in. From there, Hayes can get you into the AI room and walk you through putting the nukes back into standby. From what we've seen of these creatures, we have to assume the station's infested with them by now. So tread carefully. Let me guess. The AI room is going to have a queen. Ugh. Not looking forward to that. Definitely not. <clears throat> we do have some heavy rifles, though. Yeah, I've been told that you can put uh, mines down and they won't explode if you're on it, even if an alien is within sight or an enemy. Whoa. Power's out in the hangar bay. No, strike that. We've got massive power outages station wide. We'll need to get it back to stop that freaking Cerberus. Just another glorious day in the core. Store it. Proceed to the transit hub. Let's get this done. Dust off complete. Maintaining perimeter. Don't go too far. If we need evac, we're gonna need it fast. Roger that. Bring me back something nice, yeah? The station's basic systems are still operational. You should be able to open that door. I don't wanna. Can we just go back? Uh, I need evac. Hello? I need evac now. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, let's unlock. Hopefully we can bring the, uh... ARC here, but I think these doors are too small. Are they? Access granted. Move on. Yeah, the ARC is not going in here. That sucks. Oh, there's a data pad here. Hurry up, you slugs! That's cool. What do we got? We got some extra ammunition. Manifest report. Watch shift delta. 
1400. Arrival, Wayland Yutani Supply Shuttle Pegasus. Provision run, 8 tons unloaded. Arrival, Pioneer Station, Transfer Shuttle, shuttle Alpha 1. Sanctioned shore leave. Departure, Wayland Yutani Private Shuttle, Wayfarer, 5 passengers. Arrival, Wayland Yutani Cargo Shuttle, Pulapai, Trimonite Ore for outbound shipment, 256 tons. Departure, Wayland Yutani Supply Shuttle, Pegasus, Waste Disposal, 6 tons loaded. Arrival, Wayland Yutani Cargo Shuttle, Bentonville, there we go. Trimonite Ore for outbound shipment, 17 tons. No, it wasn't. These guys were lucky, these ones. They departed. Also, the shuttle Pegasus. Uh. Oh. Welcome to Pioneer Station, gateway to Lethe and the new frontier of the United Americas. Please observe all station regulations during your visit. Wayland Yutani, building better worlds, building the future. No, you're not. Welcome to Pioneer Station, frontier of the United Americas and human achievement. Before reporting to your commanding officer, please check in through the customs office to register any organic or otherwise restricted materials. Please also take the time to ensure that your entry visa is in order to avoid any unnecessary delays in receiving your quarters assignment and sus uh, subs subsistence allowance. The future is here. The future is Wayland Yutani. <clears throat> uh. On it. Might as well start using my stuff, right? Let's put a deploy motion, motion tracker. tracker. Setting up motion tracker. Maybe some mines as well at some point. Motion tracker deployed. Uh, how about we put a mine here somewhere? Like so. Panning mine. Wash your feet. Mine's activated. That's a pretty big mine. Come on, right. team. Hurry up, you slugs! Roger. Data pad. Hey, I found something. Let's be Looks careful. Like a data pad. Oh, there's another data pad here. I'm sending my marines out on their own, which is not a good idea, but I think we're okay here for now. Defenders of the Frontier. The colonial, colonial marines, humanity's first line of defense against the unknown. Oh. Huh. Well, yeah. Hey. I found something. Looks like a data pad. Okay. Nothing there. So we got another data pad. Introducing a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Recent expansion at Mine Comblink Storndike has created 129 new self-employed contractor positions, several with the possibility of promotion to full Wayland Yutani colleague status, and all the salary and insurance benefits that brings. Are you alpha graded in one of the following disciplines? Engineering, maintenance, disposal? If so, please contact the Wayland Yutani Opportunities Office without delay. Wayland Yutani, building better worlds, building better future. Okay, so we need to go there. Nothing there. Right now. And I wish I could get the ARC here. Oh, there's a spawn point there. I don't like that. That's Nice to have that. Unable to comply. Uh -oh. Please restore power. Hayes, this is your station. What can you give me? There's an emergency generator. Upload in coordinates now. Its access lifts on a different circuit. If it's still functional, you can bring the rest of the station online from there. Copy that. I just opened the door to the generator. But you'll have to go through the storage area, so be careful. Ugh. Yeah, that's... Should Come probably on, put a mine there. <clears throat> I mean, we're just about to get a new. Affirmative. Planning uh, mine. Watch your feet. A new command point. So might as well do that. Mine's I, activated. I really need to start using these um, command points more. What was that? Man, I love up, how tense slugs. this game is. Where the hell are we going? 
Oh, we can go in there. What's back here? Nothing, it's blocked. Oh, these doors are also open. Okay, I see. Stay frosty, Marines. Come on, team. Alright. Might as well cover our. On it. Planning mine. Cover Watch our your asses. Feet. Mine's activated. Right, let's break the weld. Cut that door open. Open up, Sesame. <clears throat> door opened. Movement! We've got movement! Uh oh. Okay. There's some long corridors. Now we can either shoot them with a sniper rifle. I see it. No. Wait. It, it's gone. Move! Move! I can weld this. Man, this place is dark. On it. <clears throat> Let's see what's inside. What do we got? Tech stuff? Move on! Good. Uh, let me see. Okay, we've got some stuff here. I got something on the tracker. Uh oh. It's in the vents, I think. Let's see what's inside. Roger. More stuff. Get some more supplies over there. Hurry up, squad! I think it's gonna be turret time. Just Get ready, Marines. Flush them all Let's out. Let's see what's inside. This kind of sucks. You can barely see what's here. But there doesn't. Oh, there's more supplies over there. Come on, team. I don't want to get too close to the doors. So I don't want to open them. Got more on my supplies way. over here. Got a data pad here. We got more supplies Let's here. See what's inside. Hey, I found something. Looks like a data pad. Right, what do we got? Terminal correspondence. Chief Yanis Adler to Deputy Administrator Mako Hayes. My grants can't keep up with these increased production quotas since the new mine complex came online. There's barely time to get one shuttle unloaded before the next arrives. Incidents of operator error on the power loaders are way up due to exhaustion. And if it keeps on like this, we'll have to start cutting corners on the inspections, just to keep everything moving. You've got to talk to McDonald and make him understand. He still doesn't trust me after that union business last year. But if something isn't done, we're going to have a major incident, and that's going to cut into his bonus. And yours. Uh, it's all about bonuses. Let's see what's inside. Oh, that thing was moving for a moment. Alright, do we have anything else? Doesn't look like it. Hurry I have a, up, you I have a feeling this is gonna be like a um, android or something. Someone's going over there, around. Okay, what Move is on. it? I don't see anything. Uh oh. Oh, it's alright. No, oh, no. Man, it's just a rat. It'll eat you alive. Kill it. Kill it. <laughs> <laughs> Knock it off, Hunslet. False alarm. Let's get back on mission. Let's see what's inside. <clears throat> Another data pad. And we're getting them in order, look. Engineering Chief Sander Morales to Operation Officer Morris Cole. I took a look at the storage elevator like you asked, and there's just no way. I can wire it into the main circuit. That thing's older than the rest of the station, and the power draw is going to cause brownouts all across the core. 
Better to keep it on its own generator for the time being. If McDonald finally comes through with that increased maintenance budget he promised, maybe we can look at something more elegant. And while we're wishing for the impossible, I'd like an all-expense-paid trip back home to Earth. Alright. I'm not gonna mine this... Oh, what's that? Something over here I missed. Oh. On my way. Might as well get it, I suppose. All alone. <laughs> this is how you do it, Marines. Janus has huge um, courage. <laughs> Come on, run, Move you slug. <clears throat> All right, let's get through here. Move, move. Headquarters. It's gonna be interesting. Oh, jeez. You're on the right track. Use that catwalk to reach the generator. I don't like this area. <laughs> Safe position taken. All right. Well, thank you very much for watching, everyone. I hope you're enjoying this. A big thank you to all of my patrons for your support, and I will see you next time when we continue with Aliens: The Dark Descent. Bye-bye.